Here's problem 6-9. A 0.2 kilogram object attached to the end of a string swings in a vertical circle, radius of 80 centimeters. At the top of the circle, the speed of the object is 4.5 meters per second. What is the magnitude of the tension in the string at this position? So we have an object on a string. It's tied to a string, and it's moving around in a circle. For it to move around in a circle, there must be a centripetal force towards the center of that circle. If we were to do a free-by diagram of this object, listing all the external forces acting on it, well, we know that in its position at the top of the circle, there will be weight towards the center of the earth, that would be down, and then there's tension, tension is always pulling inward on the cord, so the tension in this cord is also down. And as a result of these two forces, it manages to accelerate towards the center of the circle with a centripetal acceleration. Not a force, but a, an acceleration. And this would be our free by diagram for this mass. So if I were to set up Newton's second law for the motion in the positive direction of acceleration, I would say the summation of all the forces in the y direction is equal to mass times acceleration, and that is equal to the net force in the direction of acceleration. We only have two forces. We have tension and weight, and they're both in that, in that positive direction. So we'll have tension plus the weight. We want to find the tension, so we're going to subtract the mg from both sides. So our tension will be equal to mass times centripetal acceleration minus the weight. Or in other words, this is mass times velocity squared over r minus the weight. We can calculate what this is, because the mass is 0.2 kilograms or 200 grams, or 0.2 kilograms is the best to use. Uh, the velocity is 4.5 meters per second, and the radius is 80 centimeters, so that would be 0.8 meters, minus the mass, 0.2 kilograms, times g, 9.8. So if I do 0.2 times 4.5 squared, divide by 0.8, 5.06 minus 1.96 that gives me a tension of 3.10 newtons. That is the tension in the cord and it is directed downward towards the center of the circle. That's not the net force. Net force would be this tension force plus the weight of the object. But this is the tension, so the tension is being helped by the weight in this case. This is the tension towards the center of the circle, 3.1 newtons.